Alright, welcome back to Grand Tactics. Of which there are strikingly few on display. Alright. What's this artillery division? I'm gonna take command of you. If you order to actually deploy. Alright, if we can get around like Lewis's floor, we might be able to um, do something. At the moment we've got two regiments across. And the rest of my army. Can I zoom out? Yeah, I've got Davies and Kima. Or Major General Kima. Probably means that. Oh, it's just this little girl on it. It's not going to show that much. Wait, 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 we could find out. Oh, the rebs are charging. Oh, they're broken. This one, these guys are going for it. They're taking 130 losses. Twenty losses. Out of the two, the this brigade is having a much worse day. So yes, this is a colonel command. That means we've lost a, a um, major general for brigade. What's the price if these guys surrender? Uh, artillery is on target. Yes, we have got at least one artillery. Oh god, the maps are across. Perhaps we're crossing in my artillery. No, she didn't want to get in. Flanked, flanking fire, unit cut off, falling back under fire. First brigade here is broken, taking 300 losses. And the rebels are taking the same bridge. They must have got some guys across. Oh, yeah. Let's put these guys out into the line. Close in fighting here anyway. Second division, single line. My orders are all confused here. Stop. It's all time. This doesn't mean really help me much. My men have crossed the stone bridge have either fled or been captured. Oh no, they just. First we get milling around having taken four no casualties. I'm attempting to stop my cavalry from being overrun. If we got some flanky fire on these guys. Alright. 
It's like 4.30 in the afternoon on the first day of Zach Manassas. They will be retreating before the second day arrives. This was a poorly thought out idea. Unless my second lane line of artillery is up and firing. It's not going to be a bloodless, but uh, it's going to be a bit of a period victory for the Confederates. Lost 64 men. Disrupted, so command supported, but outflanked. Looks like the Confederates are trying to get someone down the bear, and like I've moved all my men off to the flank here. Well, I've got one division smashed, didn't I? The division is engaged here. First division is here. Second division. So we've got one division engaged around this field. Right, there's two divisions messing around here. Briefing reports and get reports. Combat report. Has inflicted one. Wound, killed, wounded, total 1300 men. Yeah. Generally a bad day. I don't want to bring you another unit across the ford. Alright, that's speed up time. Or oh, just order the general retreat. We've lost this one, there's no point in trying to assault a larger force across the bridge. If that objective been on this side, it would have been a bit different. Alright, now that we're getting a firing problem, but yeah, the rebels are advancing heavily. It's starting to get dark. There's no reason for us to be on the field. We had no cavalry, that's part of, part of the problem. 6 of 43 guns. 707. We actually, that was quite a bloody defeat, a victory for them. They did quite well. That was a bit off with the eyes there, but it's fine. Alright, so yeah, the combat system's got Modern Masses, ended March, fear for federal minded defeat. I'm not sure I'll drop, but yeah, we can afford those losses more than Um, Beck has become famous, but Palmer has been disgraced. So that's the thing I like to see in a game. That's looking very nice. Shame you've got an incompetent ge um, general. Alright, full core infantry. Full of core, sorry, I'm not British. Well, I am British, but yeah, I'm not using our number system. But yes, I need to be able to. Better. Better coordinate these guys, so. We have a go at Jackson's core with two core. Let's just pause up for a second. Move at time. February 4th. Move to February 6th. And I'm going to move you down to Harper's Ferry. Alright. 
and February. March you off now. Order's on its way. Alright, let's see about the army of the southwest. Naval Bombardments 1. We're bombarding Norfolk from across the channel. We've got some blockades going. Only 10% chance of British inf intervention. Right, 4th Corps. I'm sorry for that. Right, supply says 0. 555. Retreating. Unhappy in range, whatever. Right. Now, if I go across fourth call, I can have a look at them. Quite a lot of disabled men. Tell the brigades will handle quite heavily. Palmer over there. French invasion of, of Mexico. That's okay. What am I manpower like? What is my manpower like? Sorry. Pulls again in the background. Army of Mississippi. Let's create a, a couple of core for these. It's only a new division, but that's probably not too bad. Alright, I can get some Indiana men out there. I feel like 10,000 men is a, a little bit short, so I'll add another division of two infantry divisions and some artillery. I should make it free in artillery. Take a while to load those guys up. That gives the army in Mississippi a bit more option. I've only got steamers and stuff, third page, stuff like that, so. Yep, alright. Let's unpause the game and see how poorly this goes. Alright, so fifth core. And first call, I'm moving up. Hopefully we can take half of the ferry and not do too much. Naval engagements. And the river squadrons. Yep. Mississippi River Squadron, enemy five ships sunk. So we pushed them back. Army Mississippi has to, is supposed to be up to 28, but it only has 19. Results of Mississippi. Like, where are the options? Because it is an option in here. Turn off historical fonts. There we go. We don't need to be continued. It's been victory. Five enemy ships. Oh, excellent. 
by causing an objective. So yeah, we arrived. Glorious victory at Sharpsburg. Jackson's pool swinging in panic. Sex and peasants bash up and Jackson Corp retreating in panic. The commander sends us total victory and enemy ready for their lives. The news reported suffering casualties of 10 men, one killed. Yes, alright, so we should easily do. Yeah, I don't think losing 10 men counts as a major defeat. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. But, if that is actual Jackson's core, we should be able to march on Winchester with two core. Just be careful which way I point them as well. Right. Why did 4th Corps end up there? 4th Corps. Oh, damn it. I'm like, I've never even been in the army, it's still in green. So if I move 2nd Corps. What is that button? Alexandria is apparently under our control. The siege. Oh, we're sieging Harper's Ferry. Right. The monitor. Pause the game and let's see what happens. So fifth court is going to march after Jackson. We have two core following. Yep, taking half the say. I like a little markers for battles. I'll see how. See how busy that gets. Jackson's core is off, off and moving to the side there. We don't have much in the way of information on them. But if we can push them off, that means he can't come support Lee. If we can get the Winchester manufacturer as well. So that's the 5th core down here. Second core. There's no tools here for what these buttons are. Fourth mark stop. Cavalry order stance. Put you on the offensive. Offensive. Line everyone for the offensive. It's going to take a couple of hours. So if I order McCallum to march, will he bring in the other core? There's two of his calls are currently up here. I'm going to go to Winchester. Well, I should be able to go to Winchester. So Harbour Ferry gives us, like, uniforms, weapons and stuff like that. 
Hey, we should just read this life, and that's a good place to end the video. We should just read this life, and we're about to march across the river. Let's see if we can engage them. See you next time.